hey. How you doing today? Hey, are you having a good day? I hope you're having a wonderful day. You look good. I think you look beautiful today. Yeah, yeah, you look, you look fucking gorgeous, all right? I think you look fucking gorgeous today, okay? Don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise they are liars. They're liars from the pit of hell. <laughs> oh, um, hi again today. It's me, Karina McDaniels, and I'm wearing my beautiful necklaces today because today is a little bit of a special day. A uh, bit of a live format today. I'm going to be reacting live. I'm going to be my pseudo Bosch today. I'm going to be my ripoff Bosch, only with much worse quality equipment. But, uh, oh well. What is the internet other than just everybody ripping each other off, right? So, who cares? It's fine. Uh, you know who isn't fine, though? Somebody we haven't seen in a while. This fucking piece of shit. Who the fuck is this piece of shit right here? I'm just kidding. You you know who this person is. It's our good old buddy, Geeks and Gamers. Hi, Jeremy. Hi. I bet you didn't expect to see me again. Oh, I'm back, baby. I'm back again. Here I come. <laughs> We're checking out your Social Blade page today because, um, let's see how well our boys do. Oh, wow. Woo! Oh, what happened here? Holy shit! Seven, seven thousand subscribers in the past thirty days. Down fifty-six percent. Oof! 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 That is, that is yikesy. That is yikesy. Uh, down fifty percent in view. Jeremy, buddy, are you are you okay? Are, are, are you are you doing good, bud? Is, is, is everything all right? You, you got a big old B plus here. What's what happened? Dude, you you were doing just fine. You were such a stellar. Oh man. Look at that. Look at daily subscriber count. Just nothing, nothing, nothing from July the 18th. Just nothing. No, daily average 234. Now, that doesn't sound that bad until you realize this man has almost 267,000 subscribers. You know what that means? Our old buddy Jeremy is stagnating. He is stagnating hard. Look at these views, 100,000. He's, he's going strong at the beginning. Then 50,000, 40,000, 20,000, 50,000, 50, It's like he goes way up, he's going up, and then <laughs> just like crashes and burns. Jeremy, damn, dude. Only 1,000 subscribers a week? Oh, I mean... Obviously, that's more than I have. That's that's all your dumb shit idiot fanboys ever say. Is like, ha ha, you have a low subscriber count. How is he only getting a thousand subscribers a week, though? <laughs> that's kind of sad, buddy. Okay, well, who gives a fuck about it? Fuck all this shit. Um, Geeks and Gamers is back again. He's back again. He's doing his same stuff. Uh, you would think he's changed a little bit. So, clearly, you look here. Something has happened. You know, something has changed about our boy here. Um, maybe you would think he'd learn a little bit better, you know, after making like several hundred videos on Captain Marvel. You would think like maybe he would think to himself, okay, I should change up my I should change up my tactics here, right? You would think he would do that if he was a smart man. And you would be wrong. <laughs> Look at this. Brie Larson, Brie Larson. <laughs> I love that my video shows up as the third result when searching Geeks and Gamers. Oh, I fucking love that. Speaking of that, I'd like to check out the comment section of this video. Oof, 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 oof. That's quite a like to dislike. But you know what? It's all good. I don't give a fuck about any of that. Who gives a fuck about this stupid fucking number? You know what I give a fuck about? The comments. And check this shit out. Oh, ooh. Oh, man. That's, that's harsh, dude. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. 48 likes on that one, too. God. Cow. Jeremy, you just got roasted there, buddy. You just, you know not. She's racist, sexist, and just a bad person all the way around. That's something an SJW would say. 27 likes on that one. Jeremy. Dude. You're getting fucking roasted right now. God damn. Woo. Woo. Fuck. She... <laughs> She said she cares more about the opinions of other races and genders in a movie. If that's what's considered racist and sexist these days by these people, then the term now has lost all meaning. 
13 likes on that one. That's that's a that's a pretty good point, Jeremy. That's a really good fucking point. Ooh. These are, you know, you just scroll down. Jeremy is nearly 40 years old and spending his life complaining about women in Star Wars Online. This man is the poster child for how to waste your life. 20 likes on that one. Ooh. Ooh, not good. It's not good. Guys, geeks and gamers. Guys, guys, geeks and gamers. It's not good. It's not good. It's just not good. So anyway, um... Maybe we should uh, check out some of his new stuff. You know, there's a there's a reason why he might have fallen off a bit. Maybe there's something about his channel that's changed recently. Maybe he's changed something in recent years. So how about we go and look at one of his newest videos? Where is it? Right there. Oh, that's that's a, that's a very unfortunate first frame. Let me suck that dick! I wanna suck your dick! <laughs> oh, Jeremy. What are you doing? What are you doing, bud? Alright, um, so, we're not watching this at full speed. You better believe we're not watching this at full speed. So, um, I'm saving your sanity. Let's go! Oh, oh it's on! It's on! Okay. Hi, hi. Huh, oh, no. What happened? <laughs> Hi, I love Nintendo. Uh, Nintendo's my favorite game ever. I love Nintendo. Nintendo is really good. Nintendo is a great game. N my favorite Nintendo game is the the one. It's Metroid. I like Metroid. Metroid is my greatest game or my favorite game. I love Metroid, and I really want to play Metroid in a Metroid movie. Hi, uh, my name is Jeremy. I am the owner of Geeks and Gamers, and how did I get here? I'm, I'm not really sure. I'm just a big fan of Nintendo. I love Nintendo, and I want to play Nintendo games because I'm a gamer. fuck was that? What the fuck did I just witness? Is that... Is that your idea of a joke, Jeremy? Is that... Were, were you trying to make fun of somebody there? Is... This, this is... This is fucking comedy now. The right is getting better at comedy, and the left is getting scared. <sighs> All right. What's up, Geeks and Gamers? It's Jeremy, fan of Nintendo. I love Nintendo, and I want to play Nintendo games because I'm a gamer. What's up, Geeks and Gamers? It's Jeremy, coming to you with another video, and today we are talking about Brie Larson because Brie Larson fans have now created again. a live sub count yes, to show a comparison of Brie Larson subscribers to that of Geeks and Gamers. This is how weird these people are. It's yeah, how weird of that. That's weird, Jeremy. That's very weird. Um... <laughs> I don't know why you, of all people, would find that weird, because, wait a minute, aren't you the same geeks and gamers that, um, never shuts up about Brie? Look at this, Brie Larson, 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 Captain Marvel, okay, there's Captain Marvel, Brie Larson, Brie Larson, Brie Larson, okay, there's the Nissan, Brie Larson, oh, there's that piece of shit white nationalist Dave Cullen but fuck him that's not what this is about uh there's Nissan there's Ge fucking Brie Larson commercial Brie yeah you know I could imagine man those people are so weird those people are so fucking weird for wanting them to laugh for wanting to laugh at you for being an idiot and constantly just trying to shit on Brie Larson I couldn't imagine why they would want to do that it Yes, it's just so... You think I'm done? You think that's it? Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Brie... I could keep going. I made over 100 Captain Marvel videos. Brie Larson. Brie Larson. Captain Marvel. Brie Larson. Brie... Do you want me to keep going? Point has been made. Fuck it. Point has been made. It's not even about Brie Larson anymore. It's about her messed up weirdo fan base. And it's these people that have been programmed to believe that Brie Larson is some holier, holier than thou person, I guess. I don't really understand it. It doesn't make sense. But it really is entertaining to laugh at these people. Now, here we are. Uh yeah, um, unlike your audience. Oh, I'm sure your audience is totally reasonable. It's totally logical and factual and intelligent. And most of those are jokes. Um, I was made aware of this by Siobhan, our community manager. Um, and Siobhan sent this to me. And I'm like, God damn. <laughs> oh. Look at that! Jeremy! She blew your fucking ass out! Look at that! 312 to 267. Oof! Oof! When you try your best, but you don't succeed. 
When you get what you want, but not what you need. Ooh. Oof! Hey, what is that? Is that his top his top video on Brie Larson? And she's like approaching it. She she's getting there, Jeremy. She's only made like five or six videos, and she's she's fisting you, dude. She's fisting you fucking hard. Damn. Oh. And Jeremy, Jer what's funny here is that Jeremy is clearly fucking mad about it. He is like, these, these weird people want to wanna compare me. These, these weirdo people want to just compare me to Brie Larson. It's, it's not like I'm this weirdo who's made a shitload of videos on her like an abusive stalker, you know. <laughs> He's what bunch of weird people, you know. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have fucking did that. All right. What is it, 151? Let's start here. Page that's got 43 subscribers, and it looks like they started streaming this on July 26th. And so basically, it's got Brie Larson subscribers, Geeks and Gamers subscribers, a subscriber difference to show how many more subscribers she has. And I guess this is my most viewed video and her most viewed video. Interestingly enough, my most viewed video is a Brie Larson video. Um, yeah, I wonder why. You know, you know what's funny about that? Most, most of your dumb shit fanboys who made their way into my comment section, that's always what they fucking accuse me of doing. You're just shitting on geeks and gamers just to get clout. But they're defending this guy. They're defending you. What have you done? Your most viewed video is shitting on Brie Larson. And yet your dumb shit fanboys still accuse me of trying to look for clout. Irony fucking overload, dude. I don't need fucking overload. Ah. Okay. Uh, I gotta check OBS now. God damn it. I gotta make sure. Because I, I have my hotkeys all fucked up. Whatever. Fantastic. I just think this is beautiful right here. What is this meant to prove exactly? That, that a A-list Hollywood movie star it has more subscribers than me? Now again, is this is this how you rep- Really, Jeremy? Really? That That's what you think this is about? You think, oh. This Hollywood, what is it, just this Hollywood person? Yeah, oh yeah, clearly that's the reason why. Good job there. Facts and logic. Facts and fucking logic. Pay me for ele for doing the best I could to elevate a struggling YouTuber like Brie Larson. Is this how you repay me to throw it in my face that she now has more subscribers than me? I mean, that was my entire goal. If you, if you, don't, if you don't remember that, my entire goal was to help Brie Larson reach this amazing goal of 260,000 subscribers. Because if you remember her fans, her fans had an expectation that she would pass Geeks and Gamers within 24 hours. And it didn't happen in 24 hours, or even 48, or even two or three or four or five days. It took me getting involved and showing my incredible power and influence. That was the way that Brie Larson was able to get to this point. And now, Brie Larson fans, you're not showing it. Appreciation for my sacrifice. I want to suck your dick. Is he being fucking serious right now? Hold up, hold up. Is he being fucking serious? Is he trying to make a joke or is he actually being serious? I can't tell. So the beginning of it was a joke. He was clearly trying to make fun of her. It failed miserably, you know, because because it's geeks and gamers. But yeah. Uh, um, he tried so hard. Um, he tried his best, but, uh, Jeremy, not exactly an A-list comedian here. Um, so. And the other funny part is, is, is Brie Larson's channel is not doing really well, guys. Started out at 1.8 million views, hit the trending page. Amazing. Just incredible job by Brie Larson to hit that trending page. I know that was all due to hard work and dedication and had nothing to do with preferential treatment from YouTube at all. Jeremy, you know, you do a lot of shit, and you still get a lot of subscribers. He, of course he thinks this because she's a woman. Like, we all know he thinks this because she's a woman. Like, no other reason. Like, he is, he's just fucking mad. Like, <laughs> he's just fucking mad. Listen to him. You know, you know, you know Brie Larson, you only got there because you had preferential treatment from YouTube. <laughs> He's so bad! <laughs> oh, this is hilarious to hear. Who's hit the trending page? Amazing. Just incredible job by Brie Larson to hit that trending page. I know that was all due to hard work and dedication and had nothing to do with preferential treatment from YouTube at all. Second video dropped a lot. Still got a lot of views. 534,000. Got a lot of views, but uh. 
Still more views than you've gotten in a while, buddy. Uh, that's a significant drop off there, Brie Larson. And then now, her most recent video posted five days ago has yet to break 90,000 views. Incredible how far she has fallen. This is what happens when you don't have the help of me anymore because you're too busy taunting me for having 46,000 less subscribers. Wait, did he just say Brie Larson was taunting him? Wait, this was this was a fan. How is she doing? Wait. The, wait, uh, uh. I almost want to know, does Brie Larson know who Jeremy is? I, I have no, there's no way she doesn't know who Jeremy is. She would know that this man is a fucking stalker. This man has serious emotional issues that he needs to work out with a therapist that he just never got as a kid. Jeremy just, there's something fucked with his head. There, this man, this man, I've been giving conflicting numbers, but he has made at least about 250 videos on Brie Larson. What? What? rational human being thinks like that what rational human being thinks that's a good idea i don't get it there, there's something wrong with this man i swear and he's just fucking fuming that this person who he has shit on continuously every single day for the past few years is just ass blasting fisting him in the ass in terms of subscriber count it's just <laughs> It's so funny. It's funny. It's really fucking funny. It's just like, he's he's thrown so much. He's thrown everything he possibly could at her. He has shit on her in, mul in multiple videos that are millions and millions of views. And she still came back and just pounded him. Pounded him into the ground like he was just some nobody. And he's mad about it. He's so fucking upset. It's funny. I, I know why he's upset. He's really goddamn upset. Let's just finish this. This is Ever too Brie good. Larson. This is so, so terrible and hurtful. And he seriously tried to imply that, oh, well, because I stopped paying attention to you. You stopped getting it. Like, but she's still getting more views. Than, but have you seen your social blade? Look at that. Should we find Brie Larson's social blade page? We should actually do that right now. Hold up. Let me actually find Brie Larson. Let's see. Uh, let's compare. Let's compare the two. There you are. There you are. And then total subscribers weekly. She, she still has a new channel. Holy shit. Holy mother of God. <laughs> Look at that. Let's compare the two. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. She really needed your help, Jeremy. Oh, yeah. She definitely needed your... I'm sure she appreciates that. Pulling in those... She's pulling in... She's still pulling in more views. 20,000. She's still a new channel. You know, she's still new channel, so maybe you got a little bit more on the view count, but look at the subscribers, man. The subscribers are what really matter, and she is fucking fisty. She could have 339 by tomorrow. That's another 10k subscribers by tomorrow, and you are only going to have an extra thousand? Yeah, Jeremy. Yeah, keep pretending like you're the reason why. Oh yeah, that's definitely likely. Definitely fucking likely. Hi everybody, future Karina here. I lost my hat, so that's how you know I'm different. So when Jeremy claims that like he's the only reason anyone knows who Brie Larson is, what makes that claim even more laughable that I forgot to mention here is that Brie Larson, if you don't know, Brie Larson is an Oscar winner. She's an Oscar award-winning actress. She won it for her role in Room, not to be confused with The Room, but Room. Yeah, so um, to, and Jeremy had fuck nothing to do with that in terms of relevancy so <laughs> that's just just thought i'd want to add that because i forgot to do it in the video so but that just makes that claim of his even more laughable <laughs> do we even have to keep going should we have to i mean we made it this far let's just finish it this is this is comical i really believed in this community of brie larson fans because they have shown that they are common sense thinking rational people who never ever fall for any media tactics uh we all know that's bullcrap but I don't even have to point out the irony. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to show this to everybody. Uh, it's just ridiculous that these people- Look at him! He's fucking mad! He's- he's trying to- <sighs> Fucking Brie Larson! You- Yeah, it's a, your fans are totally good! Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you're not really pulling in the sub, Brie Larson! You know, I'm not mad! I swear I'm not mad! You know, I mean, he's so pissed! He's fucking mad! He's seething right now! He's fucking seething. Oh, man. He's trying to hide it. Look at him trying to hide it. Ridiculous. It's that so funny. These people 
continue. Again, comparing Brie Larson to me does not help Brie Larson. It only helps me. How do they not understand this? How do they not? Comparing you to anyone doesn't help you. I get this. And then the other thing they do is they go on all of the Geeks and Gamers social media and they just, they go after our account. Do you realize that our accounts are ran by predominantly women? Predominantly women. Yet you're constantly a don't know if that's actually true, but it's just so funny how little self-awareness this man has. This man has, this man, like, he'll always shit on Brie Larson. You don't have any self-awareness, Brie Larson. You don't know what you're doing. You're just, you're just, <laughs> coming from this guy. This guy is saying someone else has no self-awareness. Like, Jeremy, you do realize who you are. You do realize what your reputation is outside of your fart-huffing community, right? You have to know. You have to know people like me. I mean, you know me. You probably saw my video. Maybe you did. I have a feeling you're quite an ego surfer, so I, I know you saw my video. But, <laughs> I mean, my video comes up when they search your name, so there's no way you didn't. But, <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> oh, it's too good. It's too good. It's too good. Let's finish it. Attacking all of our social media accounts by saying that we don't like women. What is wrong with you people? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Stupid libtards. How, how can you claim that I hate women? <laughs> I hire women. Huh? I have a woman friend. I have a wife. <laughs> claim I hate women. What the fuck is wrong with you? Stupid <laughs> fucking libtards. <laughs> always always gotta call everyone the sexist, huh? How ironic. Oh yeah? Well, 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 well. Uh, 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 what, you realize you're criticizing a woman, right? <laughs> Oh, Jeremy, that's not a good excuse. Buddy, that's not a good excuse. Does not help Brie Larson. It only helps me. How do they not understand this? How do they not get this? And then the other thing they do is they go on all of the Geeks and Gamers social media, and yet you're constantly attacking all of our social media accounts by saying that we don't like women. What is wrong with you people? Like, Krista Nova is one that runs our Instagram. One of the sweetest people in the world. Stephanie D, another one of the sweetest people in the world. That's the person that runs a Twitter account. Yet all the Brie bots are sitting there constantly going after Geeks and Gamers social media because we don't like women this man has literally no fucking self-awareness this man jeremy you you remember my last video you covered you called her racist and sexist and just a bad person all the way around and why did you say that about her it was over her lying about stunts and saying that i and her making a joke about i don't care about 40 year old wife that's the reason you're calling her sexist that's you and you are surprised that people call you sexist are you fucking kidding me are you fucking stupid, Jeremy? Do you have... I mean, it's probably just because he's a grifter. He's, he, he doesn't believe a fucking thing he says. Although, what's scary is he might... He might know what he's saying. It's just... I don't know. This, this man... <laughs> you are either the dumbest human being on the planet Earth, or you are just completely lacking in all self-awareness. Un unbelievable. All right. Finish this garbage. The person, the person that made me aware of this is a person that runs our Discord, Siobhan, who's our community manager. Siobhan, she's a very proud member of the LGBT. I don't hate women, guys. Don't tell me I hate women. I hire women all the time, damn it. Stop saying I hate women. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jeremy, he's so, he's so like, uh, I have a woman friend. Yeah, yeah, you see the woman? There was a woman down the street. I said hi to her. I said she had good hair. How, can, how dare you call me a massage? He's so bad. He's so just like, how dare you? How dare you? BT oh, community, very proud member of it. And yet she's the one that notified me of this. It's almost, it's almost like, it's almost like these people don't pay attention to anything and they just repeat what they are supposed to be re repeating because that's what they were told to do. That's why we call them NPCs. That's why we, uh, that's why that's the perfect meme. Because Most ironic insult ever. Because it perfectly, it perfectly explains these people. You download information from the mainstream media and Hollywood. You repeat that information over and over again without doing any research whatsoever. No context, no nuance, no nothing. No, I don't even have to point out the irony. I don't, have to, I don't even have to point out what's wrong with that statement. This man has no self-awareness. What, what more do you say? Just download, repeat, download, repeat. Get your update, repeat. That's what they do. Anyway, if you guys are interested in supporting Geeks and Gamers more, please go over to our website, geeksandgamers.com. Consider becoming a premium member for only $10 a month, but for free, you can sign up for an account. You can jump into the forums, and you can be part of the discussion. You will also get a blog with your... Okay, so he's got nothing. He's done. All right. That was embarrassing. <laughs> so, um, in summary, Jeremy is mad. Jeremy is fucking upset. He is seriously, he lacks any sort of self-awareness, which is pretty obvious. Of, of course, he lacks 
pretty much all self-awareness. He is, like, really insistent that he doesn't hate women, even though he probably does. Just saying. Just saying. Like, I don't go by what people say. I go by their actions, Jeremy, and all of your actions have proven otherwise. Do you think Brie Larson is the only woman you've ever gone after? Like, I'm willing to bet most of the people he's went after is women. Now, I don't know that for sure. Like, I would have to go through his channel and... God, man, shoot me. Um, but I am, like, 99% sure most of the people he has ever done videos on are women. The, the majority of the people he's made fun of are women. Gee, I couldn't imagine why people think you're misogynist, Jeremy. I, I couldn't imagine. I really couldn't. You're just, you're just, you're just a special little snowflake. You just, like, you are really, like, you are a special guy, Jeremy. You, you, there's no way that, I don't even, <laughs> Jeremy is breaking my brain right now. I can't even, I can't even think right now, this man. Oh, it's so funny. But no, there's, there's our boy Geeks and Gamers. He's, he's just as dumb as he always was. And he's uh, a lot more irrelevant than he used to be. You know, when I was talking about him, he was kind of um, he was kind of a big deal. He kind of got off that whole high of you know the big jump in subscribers, but then all of a sudden like plummeting in relevancy. He's plummeted. Like God, he can't even get subscribers to save his life. Th this is just this is what happens. This is what becoming an SJ an anti SJW. Sorry, this is what being an anti SJW eventually does. You just plummet. You just, you get to your giddy highs, and then you just sink into the core of the earth. It, it would happen every time. You know, you just stop listening to facts. You stop actually using reason. You stop actually thinking for once. You just tow the party line. You just become a drone, which is funny. How these people came up with the NPC meme. It describes them just as easily as it describes SJWs. You know, whatever the fuck... They even think SJWs. They probably think SJWs are literally anyone on the left. And this is what happens. And that's what they do. You eventually just, all you do is nothing but stereotype. And this is what you do. You, uh, you just end up hating anyone with any other opinion than you. Being an anti-SJW, bottom line, it rocks your fucking brain. Don't do it. I'm Karina McDaniels. Have a good night.